Hi, I'm Vilus, author of the book Your First Kickstarter Campaign. In this video, you will learn how to utilize your personal and business network and how to turn them into your potential backers. All of us have some kind of network that includes family, friends, acquaintances, work and business contacts, and so on. Some have a big network, for example, if you are an influencer with a huge following, and some have a small network with just family and a few close friends. The bigger your network is, the more pledges you can expect when you launch your campaign. The first step is to divide all your contacts into a few groups depending on the way you use to communicate with them. It can be a messaging platform, for example, WhatsApp, Viber, Messenger, Telegram, WeChat, and so on, a social network, Instagram, Facebook, or LinkedIn, a newsletter program that you use to communicate with your subscribers, for example, MailChimp, Constant Contact, ConvertKit, or MailerLite, email, and finally, it can be a simple phone call. Once you have grouped your contacts, you need to prepare a personalized message. For your closest friends, it can be unique, and for others, you can use the same template, just insert the recipient's name. A message can sound like this. Hi, John, I will be launching XYZ product on Kickstarter next month. Would you like to be notified when the project is live? When you have the message ready, it's time to reach out to your contacts and mark those who agreed to be notified in a spreadsheet. Next, I will share an example how I implemented the strategy when I was preparing for my first Kickstarter campaign. As I mentioned, the first step is to divide your contacts by communication channel. In my case, I used Facebook to stay in touch with my personal network, and for business contacts, I mainly used Skype, LinkedIn, and email. Even though I had a few hundred friends on Facebook back then, I decided to contact just 50 of them, because I thought that my project will be completely irrelevant for others. However, it doesn't mean that you should do the same. You can contact all your friends on Facebook and other social networks. You may get more negative answers, but it also means that you will get more backers. So it is your call. My message sounded like this. Hi, next month I'm planning to launch a book how to start a void business on Kickstarter. Would you like to be notified when the project is live? Vilus. I simply used this template, inserted my friend's name and sent everyone a message. If they agreed to be notified, I added them to a separate list in my spreadsheet. If you use Facebook, there is one quick tip. Create Facebook event for your Kickstarter launch and invite your friends there. In this case, those who join will receive event notifications and reminders. As for the business network, I apply the same strategy for my Skype, LinkedIn and email contacts by using the same message. I use Gmail as my main email program, and I want to quickly show you how you can access all your contacts. If you use Gmail, you may go to contacts.google.com, and here you will find a list of your contacts that you communicate with. In this window, I hid emails of my contacts, however, you can click on this icon, list settings, choose change column order, and here choose email. That's all. Click on done, and you will see the email address in this window. Now I will cancel it. Finally, you can export all your contacts to the CSV file by choosing Google CSV or Outlook, whatever program you use, and click on Export. Next, I will show how you can automate personal outreach strategy by using Gmail add-on yet another mail merge. 